I'm Alex Cherian, film archivist at San Francisco State University, and this is the Education Archive. You're about to watch news films shot by KTVU in April 1968 in Oakland, featuring Marlon Brando's speech at the funeral of Bobby Hutton. Bobby Hutton was the first recruit of Oakland's Black Panther Party and was killed in a gun battle with police at the age of 17. Brando was involved for many years with the civil rights movement and had spoken eloquently about racial hatred. But here, his address is more urgent. He feels that debate has been exhausted and it's time for society to act now. This report shows Brando joining with the community to express its anger over the death of a teenager in a nation at war with itself. Thank you. We just came from um, Bobby Hutton's funeral. And I'm not going to stand up here and make a speech because white people, you've been listening to white people for 400 years. They said they were going to do something. They haven't done a thing as far as I'm concerned in re-enfranchising the black man. It's up to the individual to do something to force the government to give the black man a decent place to live, a decent place to bring his children up in. That could have been my son lying there. And I'm going to do as much as I can. I'm going to start right now to inform white people of what they don't know. The Reverend said, the white man can't cool it because he's never dug it. And I'm here to try to dig it. Because I myself as a white man have got a long way to go and a lot to learn. I haven't been in your place. I haven't suffered the way you've suffered. I'm just beginning to learn the nature of that experience. And somehow that has to be translated to the white community now. Time's running out for everybody. That's enough. That's enough talking. Funeral services for Bobby Hutton, who was shot and killed last Saturday night by Oakland police, were held here at the Euphrasian Church of God in Christ this morning. Thank <laughs> you. 